Oh my god, we are back at the dude watches K-pop and doesn't know how to sleep. Oh, and people kind of liked the guitar before, so how about a cool chord for our K-pop? K-pop time. That, of course, is a G6. Did I play it in the key of G? I did. A G6, 9, sharp, 11 chord. How do you know it's a sharp 11 and not a flat 5? Because the 5 is still present in the chord. No one cares about that. That's just to lend authority to my guitar playing skills. Anyhow, I'm acting a little weird, or a lot of weird, because uh, last night I only slept for two hours. Don't know why. Got up and was like, what would a smart guy do? Because sleeping is smart, and that's, so I'm not, I'm not doing that part. I'm messing that up. What would be smart? So that's for my taxes. I would do like 30 minutes of taxes, then play Rocket League, and then some more taxes, and then Rocket League, and taxes, and Rocket League, and before I knew it, finished my taxes today. But then only took a nap for an hour, so like in the last... 48 hours, 36 hours, I've only slept for three hours, so I'm a little, a little kooky. Anyways, you know that we're here for BTS House of Cards, which I'm doing because I thought Singularity was straight fire. I need like a set of phrases to say instead of straight fire and nice and dope. Anyways, I need to get to that later. But people said, dude, if you think Singularity is hot, you should do House of Cards. So that's what we're doing. Also, somewhere around this video, right, right before it or after it, uh, me and my buddy Josiah will be reacting to Fake Love. We already recorded that like a week ago. That's his last video of the set with him, for those of you who know who Josiah is. Uh, my two other videos that I'm going to do, branching out today, spicing things up, Akmu Play Ugly and the new Dean video, which I think is Dayfly? Is that right? I don't know. We'll figure it out by the time I get there. And this is a fan-made video, because I like videos. I mean, I mean, if there's lyrics, I have to like look at the lyrics and then pretend that I'm entertaining enough to do something while we watch lyrics. And I'm, uh, I'm, not, that, I'm not that good. I'm not even really good enough for the regular music video. <laughs> Uh, that's weird. Um, okay, what's weird? <laughs> Bruh, don't be so tired. Um, the chords are really cool, the piano chords that came in, and I would always expect a second repetition of those chords because they're so nice and light, and instead we had cellos come on top like really powerful, which is an odd thing to do. And I had to pause and say something because I think there's a chance we're not going to hear it done that way again in the song. <laughs> I do really like it. Sorry, I'm zoned out. I'm like trying to listen to where that hi-hat is. The hi-hat was like coming in on like just the ands. And then it was coming in on like every thing. And then I was trying to figure out how I wanted to count it. Like maybe I should count it at half speed. I don't know. So that's why I'm zoned out. I love the tempo of this song. This is doing one of those magical things, uh, which I mean, yeah, a lot of songs can do it, where the tempo is real slow and direct. Boom, 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 boom. So you can move at that speed, or you could double it up. Boom, 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 boom. Like if you're dancing, or jamming along, or improvising, or whatever. <laughs> That's slick, so they switched to, they replaced the cellos with an upright bass, 
And then the bass was playing at the same time that the cellos would normally play. Uh, the cellos were playing pizzicato, and then the bass was playing. And then it moved to a walking bass line, which is really, you know, common jazz thing from like, I don't know, the 40s on. <laughs> I did that video, I forgot what video that was, but I did think him like dipping that lollipop was that, I didn't know if it was soda or coffee. And plus y'all, I'm telling you like, it just happened, it just happened that like summer, spring came like today. Like in the last 48 hours, it happened. They are the two hottest days, so like the house is not the uh, you know temperature it should be. So like I'm like got to dab that sweat up. How do you dab? Dab that sweat. Melody, um, that was that like a dominant chord? It didn't matter. It had a diminished type of feeling. Uh, diminished. What the hell does that mean? Uh, um, think of an old movie, like an old movie or a cartoon, and like the girls like tied up, or whoever's been kidnapped is tied up on the railroad track, and then the, here comes the train. The chord that they would play uh, when you you heard the train coming, um, you know, like. Something like, you know, but they're, obviously, they didn't, we did not hear a guitar there, but that melody that they just sang was fire. Can I go back? I never go back. I just want to hear that melody one time. It was on the very first, and by the th by the third note, it was out. So it was either it was like the first two notes of that descending line. This is where I feel like I'm getting bored. Let's keep moving. Oh, I guess I didn't give you a verdict yet. I do love this song, and it's giving me a whole. Um, just like EXO did, EXO is giving me two sets of songs that I love. Songs that are like straight fire dance music and then like slower jams. Like um, I would say 24-7 falls in there. Uh, Hurt, uh, Smile on My Face. And now BTS has got me with the singularity and now House of Cards where I can make just like a set of like, I don't even know. You know, like this thing, like, I should make a snap. That playlist. That's a different playlist. I do love that type of thing we just heard. Uh, we heard a snare drum that was kind of hollow-ish sounding, but it went, it went, bum, 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 bum. It gave us four hits. A bop, bap, 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 and then disappeared. It came in just for those four. Notice how everything's empty? So a lot of times you have a drum fill that either takes you from section to section, or a drum fill will take you into, here we go. And so the drums do a fill and then come in hard. And I love a trick like this, which is, I really don't hear that often, which is you, you bring in the drums and they take them right away. They just disappear. Gone. I'm 
mean, obviously, we still have a snare on like one and three or two and four, or wherever we are in the beat structure. But you, usually, you have the fill to build up energy to bring in a much more elevated amount of rhythm. That would not be an appropriate rhythm for the song, but you know what I'm saying. You, you'd be filling in more of the gaps with percussion, and instead, it acts like it's building, cuts out the drums a little bit, increases the texture of the whole song, and that's our buildup. <laughs> First time we've heard the string section split in half, where well, we're going low, high, low, high, low, high. I think it is. I mean, we've obviously had them split by register the entire time, but as far as rhythmically, I think this is the first time we heard boom, dum, dum, dum. I, I didn't sing. I didn't sing what I did with my hands, but you know what I mean. <laughs> song was great. Uh, what are all my catchphrases? That song was straight fire. That song was so dope, bro. Dope song ever. Uh, when you make hundreds of videos, you start to realize you don't have as much variety as you would like. I need to find more phrases. But y'all, most of y'all probably right now are like, dude, I've never even seen you and I'm, never, I'm not even going to watch you again. So who cares what you say? But some of you might come back. And I gotta do something other than just wave my hands up and down in the air. That song was awesome, BTS, House of Cards. That was great. You guys were really right. Um, it paired well with Singularity. Now I have to go back and dig through the comments of Singularity because I think you gave me some other recommendations for songs like that. Word. Um, now we're on to Akmu. Akmu. Ah, like ah, like father, Akmu, right? Akmu, oh, which is, what's his name? Chaniok and Suhyun? Ooh, I should double check the names, but I think that's what y'all said their names was. And uh, then we're going to do Dean Dane Fly. So we're going to a little off kilter. BTS is pretty down in the middle. And then um, I think Akmu and Dean is, you know, branching out. Like, I'm, I think I'm going to have a good time. And uh, also find that fake love video somewhere. Maybe I'll put it in the end cards. Oh, if this is the end part, maybe it's in one of the cards if the videos come out by now. Well, I don't even know which side I put them on. This side? Am I pointing at a video right now? I, if it's not this side, then it's that side. I don't know. See you over there. <laughs> 